Well, the heartbreaking death of a six-year-old has now led to his mother being sent to prison. That West Dallas woman pleaded guilty to abusing her young son, abuse that led to his death last September. CBS 58's Ellie Nakamoto White is live at the courthouse with the latest. Ellie? A judge sentenced Tasha Rockow to 33 years in Wisconsin State Prison. That's followed by 12 years of extended supervision, a ruling she says is fair for Rockow's senseless actions. In short, you tortured this child. That's unforgivable. An emotional day for many. You are the cause of his death, whether you like it or not. As the mother responsible for the death of six-year-old Hank Brown Rockow was sentenced on Thursday. He didn't deserve any of this. Police originally responded to reports of a child with a stab wound in September 2021. According to the criminal complaint, when first responders arrived on scene, they found the six-year-old with gray skin, bruises from head to toe, and human bite marks. You withheld food from him. You didn't allow him to sit on the furniture. He's not a dog. He is a human being. The Milwaukee Medical Examiner's report says Hank did not die from the stab wound, but from other blunt force trauma to his abdomen as a result of ongoing abuse. His children, including Hank, are our greatest resources, ma'am. They are the best, they are the brightest, and they light our way for our future. As for Rockow, so the convicted mother expressed again. remorse mother before will. sentencing. Please find it to forgive me and watch over your brothers. I'm sorry I failed as your mom. The judge also says that Raquel may not have any contact with her other two children. She says that could change, though, if they request that they want contact. And if that happens, then their respective fathers must meet with therapists who also agree. That'll change once the two children turn 18 and are adults and can make their own decisions. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Ellie Nakamoto-White, CBS 58 News.